Yo, what's good, everybody, man? It's your boy, Kobe, in the mix. Jeez. Today, we got the Nets taking on the Jazz, man. The Nets got that big win yesterday against the Portland Trail Blazers. And I'm telling you, man, James Harden ain't do that shit with Kyrie or KD. He did that shit by himself, and especially with his team, man. They just clicked, and they beat Portland. So tonight, man... They have a chance to go on a two-game win streak against two big teams, man. They're going against the number one seed in the West right now, the Utah Jazz. And like I said, James Harden is doing this show without Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving, man. So it would be a big dub if the Nets can pull this one off tonight. But for any videos or any feedback you guys want to give me, you guys can comment down below this video or hit me on my Twitter or Instagram at Kobe in the mix. Whew, 100 subscribers, man. The video is officially dropping tomorrow, but I'm going to be dropping a video giving you guys the details and how the, how the giveaway is going to be taking place. So be on the lookout for that. Make sure you guys hit that notification bell again. I mean, I said again. Make sure you guys hit that notification bell again so you guys can keep up with the latest content. And giveaways will be going live tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. I'm giving away four total things, two PlayStation cards and two Xbox cards. But this is the last video of tonight, man. So without further ado, man, let's get right into the video. Back home is their first game in a long time. They've only played one home game in the past 27 days. Obviously, part of that was the All-Star break. Or Kyrie Irving or Kevin Durant. And consistently score against the best defenses in the league as Donovan Mitchell hits a pull-up three. James Harden not playing tonight? Tyler Johnson was given... Nash some nice what the hell is James Harden doing on the bench? He eating? What the fuck he doing? They gonna, they gonna play him? Bro, he's literally on the bench, bro. I don't even know what James Harden is doing. 31 and 11, though. Brooklyn is 30 and 14, second in the East. I don't know what the Harden is doing, bro. This dude is literally just sitting on the bench, bro. I guess he's not playing tonight. Fuck it. I don't know what he's doing. And I love that ever since the bubble, they really he might be playing. They might just be having him come in later. I don't know. Shot. For franchise records or for the lead. Mitchell on the drive gets inside on an easy bucket for Mitchell. What do you think missing a free throw does for your confidence, Mike? <laughs> Shatters it. <laughs> Conley mm. gets inside. Nice. I play off the glass. They don't play hard, man. It's going to be a fucking slaughter. I'd be surprised if the Nets can pull this one off without James Harden. Time a little running left hand hook. And no hesitation from Conley. Nails another three. In Utah, it's very, very similar. But it's underplayed there. I don't think he's playing tonight. Andre Jordan has come into the game and quickly contributes for Brooklyn. Shot clock down to five. Mitchell has Jeff Green. 16 6, 10 point game. Big three. That's good. Not a Mitchell from downtown. They've been four of their first five from three point range. Yeah, I fuck with the court design, though. And they jerseys, man. Them jerseys go hard. Cabarro drives. Can't finish, but Jordan on the tip in. So a good substitution from Steve Nat. Mitchell guarded by. Bruce Brown using the screen. Shot. Shot. And everything going down right now for Utah. They're 8 of 12 overall for the field. Jeff, you talk about this all the time. Today's NBA, there really is no lead that's safe. No, and I think. Uh, Damn, look at the score 8 24. A 14 point first half lead. OB, Brian. Damn, they fucked up the score. Cabarro draws the foul. Last two months, he has been playing the best basketball of his career. Let's turn it over. Royce O'Neal with an easy two. And the Jazz have 29 points with 415 remaining here in the first period. He's going to have to make plays off the dribble to help his teammates. And I think he keeps improving in that area. Three -pointer down the other I honestly end. think Utah is not going to make it out the West. Bro, I don't know. Lakers, man. I think the Lakers is going to go crazy, man. AD and LeBron is going to come back. They're going to do some crazy-ass shit, man. They're going to try their hardest to make it back to the finals, man. But I don't know, man. The Suns could be dangerous. Utah can be dangerous, but we just got to wait and see, man. It's too early to tell. Any team can be good in the season, but come playoffs, man, that's where it really matters at. But I think Utah will make it to the second round, though. That's good. 
Chris Chioza from downtown. His first point. 33 17. So many rumors going around, various players. Of course, we'll have it covered. Mm. Big three in the corner. There's seven of 11 from three point range. Chris Chioza gets inside, throws it back out. Claxton tries a three. That's good. And that was tremendous defense by Claxton against Clarkson. One on one guarded multiple moves. Jeff Green gets in. His floater is up and good. And Green, after starting 0 for 5, gets his first bucket. That is won't go. Rebound tipped and taken by Angles. Jazz by 16. And Chioza comes up with a steal. And after mm. that rough start, the Nets have kind of regained their footing. Roster being depleted with COVID, got a chance to play in the bubble. They signed him in June. He played in the bubble and played well for them. Mitchell, that's a three. And did it with their defense in the fourth quarter. Held Portland to 21. Well, they are shorthanded tonight. Nice pass from Mitchell. Favors actually said if this were the 45, 28, 10. But there's no I want to know why Harden wasn't playing tonight. He literally has his shoes on and everything, but he's just not playing. Consecutive game and 19 of the. he need to come back. Those calf injuries are nothing to try to rush back. They can be problematic, and they can be reoccurring. Some teams like the Clippers. We had them a couple games ago. They had seven guys at that point. I believe over 40 percent as Bogdanovich. Say. Well, the Clippers, their number. 53 one, to 31. Three point percentage. Turning over the ball like crazy. Royce O'Neal was down the other end. What, Blake Griffin not playing tonight? Reset to 14. Tyler Johnson short. Alizé Johnson the rebound. Flips it up, and that's good. You know, the stars may be out. They may be getting blown out. But people are watching. Net front office and other front offices as Tyler Johnson with a very strong finish going to his dominant left hand. Well, you got to capitalize on that. By the way... And Chioza runs down the floor, lays it up and in. Seven points for Chioza. 21-point game. Final minute, second quarter. Conley for the rim. Little beer there to clean it up. Good back. boy. Got clock turned off. Mm. Drive and Mitchell to finish with 1.9 remaining. They're going to have to move it, and then they're going to have to yes. shoot three well. And he I was looking play. forward to this game, man, but Harden not even playing tonight. Shit. It's a 10 possession game. 68 38, 30 point game. <laughs> Bogdanovich from outside. And makes it an 11 possession game. Guavo Cabarroa. There's a lot of dribbling and able to finish. Got it blocked by Gobert. That's his third rejection. He had nine in his last game. Which was tied his career high as Donovan Mitchell. Man. Yeah, you can tie it up with a half court shot. We need something. Where's Khalif? Are you good? Get up. Claxton slow to get up. Mitchell for three. Mm. That's good. So fucking slaughter, bro. Well, you speak of the playoffs last year. Yeah, the Nets get it inside. 40 point game. Oh, it was not that yet. Not yet. Ain't a 40 point game yet. Damn. And this time as Alizé Johnson gets it inside, throws Bruce Brown, and his shot is up and good. Because either they don't like the situation, they're not getting playing time. And they're NBA trade deadline is Thursday at 3 p.m. Eastern and time. Johnson. You know you're going to be making some trades before then. Mitchell, one-on-one, -on -one, little fake. Johnson does a good job. Yeah, he so he in the mall, man. I know they're going to be making some trades. Points for Utah with five minutes to go in the third. as Bruce Brown scores. The New York Knicks and the Orlando Magic, what are they both trying to accomplish? Well, uh, the Knicks right now... We about to be seeing a lot of crazy-ass trades among. edges ...for a team that uh, very likely is going to be in the playoffs and has shown... Uh, Shot. It's a remarkable improvement this year under Tom Thibodeau. You know, they've been talking throughout the afternoon, evening uh, with teams. You know, I think Boston remains involved, the Denver Nuggets, uh, Minnesota... You know, has continually talked with yeah. uh, about boarding with them. And that's going to be 30 and 15, man. This game is over. You take Mike Conley. Yeah, but Brooklyn and be in the finals, mark my words on that. Utah has a chance. Suns has a chance. But 
Lakers ain't gonna have that shit, man. I think they gonna try their best to make it to the finals. Cause LeBron and AD is gonna be good by then. But we just want to see him wait, and hopefully Golden State takes off next season. I'm not a Golden State fan, man, but I just want to see them go back to that, you know, playoff status, doing damage in the playoffs, man. Cause Steph and Clay, man, that shit's crazy. Playing at altitude in a back to back against a dominant team who's just absolutely great at home. And that's what this kid is doing. This is just his 32nd NBA game in his third season. Shot. In the NBA title this year. Yeah, his game was over. over. 17th in a row. On their Damn, the Jazz got 17 games in a row? They improved to 32 and 11. Damn, that's a golden that. That's a good ass record, man. 32 and 11. So that makes the Nets 30 and 15 now, man. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. This was uh, this was the last video of tonight, man. But I'm gonna be going into detail tomorrow and how the giveaway is gonna be taking place and all the rules you guys need to know, man. It's clearly simple, but I'll be explaining it to you guys tomorrow. So I'm gonna be dropping a lot of fucking videos tomorrow. I'm going to have the giveaway video tomorrow. Actually, I'm going to take that back. We're going to have one. We're going to have two videos. One video explaining how the giveaway is going to take place. Then we're going to have that 100 sub special. And then I'm going to be doing NBA reaction videos tomorrow. And then I'm going to have a banger video dropping for you guys on Friday. So stay tuned for that, man. Like I said, man, we're officially at 100 subscribers. I want to just thank you guys. Take the time. To show my appreciation to you guys and do a giveaway for you guys tomorrow, man. So, man, let's get to 200 subscribers now, man. Little by little, we're going to take baby steps, baby steps. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I'm grinding to a 1,000. That's the primary goal right now, man. But we got to take it little by little. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. It's your boy, Kobe. And I'm signing out. Peace. Sheesh.